Right, I'll show you a little bit uh, just the basics of ModScan, which is a freeware available on, the, on our website that allows you to scan through a Modbus network. Um, you just need to launch the software and um, uh, the first thing that this will require is to properly set uh, the connection um, details of your to the, of your network. So just click on connection and connect. Uh, set the right COM port of the converter uh, connected from the computer to your network. The um, baud rate, the word length, the parity, and the stop bits. Normally eight, none, and one are the defaults. Normally, once you press OK. The, the next thing you'll have to do is to set the device address. So this is the, the network address of your target controller you want to read and then press the connect button. This is used to disconnect from your device. So we reconnect once again, we reset the controls, the pulling. So as you can see I'm starting already to read on some of the addresses of the network device some values. I can change from coil status to input status or holding registers. So, For example, here I'm reading already some values. These are temperatures. In my case, in these specific applications, the target software is an air handling unit software where Modbus address number 12 as a holding register is my supply temperature at 28.5 degrees. So through this I can scan through my network and easily see the correct uh, reference of my Modbus list to the to the software. Modbus allows this uh, software also allows you to display information in different uh, ways. So by clicking any of these icons, you will see the same information shown in different ways. Um, to connect uh, to your um, to your to disconnect from the from the control display, press the disconnect button. 